how does merge sort decompose this sorting problem? Some of you drew a tree like this. This is a fine decomposition because it stops in a consistent way. Whenever it gets to a list with just two elements, there are no further subproblems. If our program follows this decomposition, then it would have a case for when the list has just two elements. And in that case, our program would not sort any smaller list, but rather, I guess, compare the two numbers to see which one comes first and which one comes second. So it is a fine decomposition as long as it stops consistently and we program accordingly. However, I'm going to use a finer decomposition that makes our sorting program even simpler. When I get to a two element list, I'm going to decompose it further into two one element lists and only then do I stop. And I'm going to do that consistently throughout my decomposition so I get this tree. This way, as you'll see, our program will have a case not for when the list has just two elements, but for when the list has just one element. Now, some others among you got to a one element list, but then went further and decomposed it into two halves, which are a one element list and an empty list. It doesn't matter which on which side. The only problem with this decomposition is that it's not yet consistent. If we decompose this one element list into two halves, then we should also decompose this one, and then this one, and then this one, and so on, so our sorting program would never finish. So let's not do this. Okay, so we're going to go with this decomposition. Our sorting program will use this decomposition, so let's write a data definition for it. I'm gonna call this a merge tree. As you can see in the picture, there are two kinds of merge trees, the kind that splits and the kind that doesn't. The kind that splits has two subtrees, so let's define the structures to store them, called split. The kind that doesn't split has just a number, so let's define the structures to store it, just called single. Let's define some examples of merge trees by translating this picture into words that Dr. Racket can understand. Let's define MT0 to be a single merge tree, and then define MT1 to be a split merge tree that contains MT0, and then define MT2 to be a split merge tree that contains MT1. 